So in this video, I'll show you how to build email sign up form from scratch. So let's go to my computer and do a step by step tutorial. Okay. So let's now create the single stepped opt in form. So log into your Clavio account, click on sign up forms and create a form and filter by, I want to collect emails and I like this uh, pop up form and they are collecting some additional information we'll we'll see if we want to collect it or not so click and let's do clavier mastery 3.0 video newsletter create a form okay so as you can see it has 20 percent off the teaser let's change the teaser i want it to be um you can do $20 off $20 off I like the color you know what let's change the color to something more flowium like uh, or you know what orange because it would be on our website or green okay perfect green is good looks good again I'm just testing and let's do show before and displaying this is before and after show the close button we want to do it okay and let's do this is a survey yeah looks good but instead of survey what i want to do is just collect email so instead of this i don't care about this so just delete okay so we have we have image you can replace it let's say you replace it with our yeah so this, let's promote this get 20 dollars off our email design i don't know just just playing around how to change the color as in any software just select the, the text and let's do something bluish yeah in line with yeah i like this same thing here space so we have um, some kind of space between yeah perfect uh, maybe later this is kind of maybe later instead of having close button uh, this is the text when they click on this link it will be this form will be closed okay so also i want to add countdown timer so let's say it the promo will run center till april 30th okay and also we need to kind of change the color which is when we want to do this kind of blue or you want to keep any other color so now we have we change the image we change the text color let's change also color in this form uh label email no actually we don't we don't want to show the label i don't like it so we have an email address here uh instead of putting um we can put your your email address and we want this mail is invalid in case they enter the, the wrong way okay so we have that go to style menu because i want to change the colors so i want to change the i don't know something blue uh, you know what let's go here and learn what blue it is click down to go to menu uh, link color this color this color yeah so we have text we have yeah so we have everything here which is good uh let's do the the button as well and for text i want bold yeah with bold and maybe later also okay so now we i just redesigned it again i use a template so i didn't design it from scratch one thing what i would love to do is change the background of this uh the left side make it more white so how do we do it we just go to styles and you see the background color uh let's do let's try white 100 percent white oops yeah 
maybe it's too wide but just for this example again i'm not not the designer i just want, want to um, show you an example and one thing i would like to add is add this block and add sign up counter sign up counter we want to change the color mm. so we select this color we do this yeah and it looks looks good to me yeah so we have this is one step so we have a teaser which is you know what let's change it yeah so we have green uh get and let's do get 20 percent off and let's do it not custom but let's do medium yeah medium is good uh we have a close button we have everything's good then we have after that we have not a survey let's edit name email form rename so we have a teaser we have email form and we have a success don't forget to change the success form so let's replace it with the same image select this one go back again to style let's change color is it white yeah it looks like white okay let's change the color of this text change this we don't need coupon code so i'll be deleting just yes, delete keep me shorting shopping yeah so let's and i want to do it left justification so i click on fit to the text and do the left i don't know i like this better and we want to do the uh, yeah i like this better so now you have a teaser you have email form sign up and a success message okay and the last thing they need we need to set up is the behavior since this is exit intent pop-up oh it depends what are you trying to get here let's say if it's exit intent pop-up form what you do you just unselect those and when visitors is exiting the page it will uh, trigger when somebody trying to close the page or scrolling on, on the phone and they will see this form also you can have multiple rules let's say when somebody trying to close the page but all only after five seconds if they trying to close the page after three seconds it, that form will not show up or you can just show it to everybody who's five seconds on their website or more if it's time based i would strongly recommend to go to your google analytics and see what is a uh, average bounce rate on your website let's say if it's a uh, one minute 15 seconds you are safe to make this like 60 seconds or so forth if it's 30 seconds you you should do it at 45 seconds also you can do it by scrolling certain amount of page let's say if you want to show it only to people who scroll 50 percent of your page they will see the message or you can also do this i, I love this personally after they visit a uh, certain amount of pages let's say if they have visited three plus they are more interested in in your brand versus if they accidentally landed on your website also let's say if they did not submit the form but they just close it how soon do you want to show it again you you can just say i don't want to show it or you can be aggressive let's say show it every day or five to seven days is a rule of thumb also where do you want to show this form this one is optimized more for desktop actually maybe not yeah actually it's uh, also optimized for mobile but no image so just make sure to click between those two icons to see how it, how each step looks on mobile as well so this is teaser this is email form and this is success message we just covered how to build your email sign up form in the next video i'll show you how to build two-step sign up form where you collect emails and after that you collect their phone number for sms marketing